Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Today we are trying out a variety of instant noodles from Korea, from jajangmyeon to kimchi noodles to udon, and we even have like really spicy ones. So this is gonna be another epic video. We have eight different types of noodles in front of us, instant noodles from Korea, and I hope we can get through this. <laughs> I hope so. More than half looks spicy. Yes, yes, but I, I like spicy noodles. Me too. But I think I'm okay. You think you're okay? But one is called Angry, and it says three times hotter than their regular version, which is probably spicy to begin with. And you know, we have had very spicy Korean noodles before. This one, it's written in Japanese, mm. so I can read it. Kimchi ramen. Shaki shaki no kimchi iri. Inside, they are crispy kimchi. Mm. And this is from a company called Jonga. Jonga. Okay. Open it. Inside, there are two packages. Uh -huh. One is powder thing, and another one, oh, real kimchi. Real kimchi. Kimchi. Okay, you add the kimchi pack into the bowl. Mm. The noodles look thin. Mm -hmm. Looks just like regular cup of noodles to mm -hmm. me. It's real kimchi. Real kimchi. I've never seen real kimchi in instant cup ramen. Oh, hot water until the line. And cup man come back. Cup man come back. So what I like immediately about this one is the, the kimchi. Mm -hmm. The soup is really red. Very and red. The smell is very nice. Itadakimasu. Yum. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This one is um very typical kimchi ramen for me. The texture is really good. It's fresh kimchi texture. Mm -hmm. It's not super spicy for me. Me neither. I think it has the right amount of uh, spiciness. Mm -hmm. And I think my favorite part of this mm -hmm. is the, the uh, sourness of the kimchi. Because once again, they're using longer fermented uh, kimchi, That's which right. is usually used for, mm. you know, dishes anyway. Mm. Next one, it's jajangmyeon. Yes, by Paldo. And I love jajangmyeon. Jajangmyeon is uh, noodles with uh, black bean sauce. I used to eat this all the time with my good friend Alan, um, who's a Korean family when I was a kid. And they used to always take me to the local jajangmyeon uh, restaurant in Hawaii. Hey. So I kind of <laughs> grew up with this. So I'm hey. looking forward to this. Is it mm. spicy? Not at all. Not, Not spicy at all. all. It okay. shouldn't be. At least. Okay. Uh, this one is supress, supress noodle. So inside there is a big package. It's a jajang sauce. Right. And you're supposed to put this on top of the hot water. Okay. On top of the this container. Pour hot water. Close the lid. And cup man, please. And place the sauce on top of the cup. Okay. So it is time to drain the water. Mm -hmm. Make sure you drain it well. And then you mix the sauce into the noodles. Look at that. Look at that glistening, beautiful black bean sauce. Looks so delicious. And make sure you mix it up really, really well. Divide it into two and we are ready to eat. Mm. Mm. It's sweet. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. These are pretty good. These are, this is pretty good for instant jajangmyeon, I gotta say. But I think because this is instant, instant noodles, noodles. Mm -hmm. they're not as firm as the fresh noodles you get at the restaurant. But the sauce, you have the sweetness from the onions as well. And it should have that, that a little bit um, roasted taste. Because that's from the pan, pan, taste. pan frying ah, the, the, I see. the sauce, mm -hmm. I think. I like this mm. sweetness of this sauce. Yeah, yeah. Mm. I do too. Inside of so this sauce, mm -hmm. I taste a little bit the essence of onion. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's like a very, very, very well sauteed onion. Yeah, yeah. They're, they have a lot of onions in the sauce. Ah, I see. Yeah. I see. So, next one is pretty interesting. It's labokki. Yeah, it's very it's interesting. It's from Jonga. Mm -hmm. Labokki is a combination of ramen and topoki. There is like the two packs, there's the vegetables and the labokki sauce, but mm -hmm. I only see instant ramen on the inside. Mm -hmm. This one is also supress noodle. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's make. Okay. Open the lid and put dried, freeze dried vegetables on top of noodles. And pour hot water and close the lid. Wait for three minutes. 
and put the sauce on top of the lid. We have to drain water. Drain water, drain hot water, and pour this looks spicy sauce. Okay, mix, 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 mix. Divide into two. Let's eat. Okay, so uh, the vegetables look like green onions. I see pieces of carrots in here. Mm -hmm. And once again, it's a red, reddish sauce. Um, this is a gochujang based sauce, uh, hot and sweet sauce, Korean hot and sweet sauce. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's very interesting. Um, it's sweet. Yes. It's surprise. Yeah. Surprise, surprise, surprise. It says hot and sweet sauce. But I almost feel like um, it is sweeter than even the jjajangmyeon. Mm. Essence of spiciness, hot spiciness, but it's very subtle. Mm. Okay, now I, I do have a little bit kick coming through. So, next one is pretty interesting because I have, this one is from Nonshin. Um, there is a, a Japanese, Japanese instruction outside of this package. Okay, well, let's open this up and there is one packet of soup mix. And I guess we make this like um, the other noodles. We, we pour in some hot water and we wait. Okay, it's ready. And mix well. Oh, there are tempura. Pieces of um, shrimp tempura, I believe. They're like small pieces of shrimp tempura. I also see some kamaboko fish cake, uh, wakame seaweed, green onions. And the soup is the color of um, soba soup or udon soup. A little bit on the darker side. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And the noodles are a little bit thicker than yeah. the previous noodles. Yeah, and it smells a little bit Japanese, I gotta say. Hmm. Hmm. I like the texture of the noodles, you know, kind of bouncy. Um, the texture of these noodles um, between ramen and the Japanese udon noodles. How about this tempura? The tempura, that's right. Interesting, is that shrimp? I don't know. It has a like, texture of fish cake to me. Mm, like, like that? Yeah. Like that? Like deep fried mm. fish cake. A mm -hmm. little bit scared, next one. Yeah, so the next one is the... Uh, Nongshin Angry Nail Goody Noodles. And this is super spicy seafood cup noodle soup, three times the spicy level of their normal one, which I'm assuming it's spicy to begin with. <laughs> is this soup noodles? Uh, this is soup noodles. Soup noodles. Soup noodles, for sure, yeah. And so it, it comes with um, the soup packet. And the, the cool thing is that there are these cute fish cake that looks like tanuki. I think they're called raccoons in English. I'm not exactly sure. So this is a soup noodles. So pour a soup packet, hot water, close up lid, and wait for four minutes. Mm -hmm. And it's ready in no time. And this is what it looks like. What do you think? Spicy. It does, it smells <laughs> spicy. Um, I do have, once again, um, the fish cake is really cute. I think the very, very well designed. Yeah, <laughs> very it cute. kind of makes it special. Mm -hmm. It's delicious. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, does it have like a, I don't know, it reminds me a little bit of like seafood, like, <coughs> like clam. Spicy? <coughs> it, it is spicy, but it's... This one's really delicious. Mm, is it seafood? Seafood? Huh? Mm -hmm. uh, it is seafood. Seafood? Super spicy mm. and seafood noodles. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good ah. dashi. Good broth. Mm. Mm. I like this, but oh, the it spice is game. It is spicy, but it's not unbearable. Oh, mm. I'm getting hot now. It's warm in here. <coughs> <coughs> See? <laughs> It is spicy. <laughs> the spice yep. affected you earlier than mm -hmm. it affected me. Mm -hmm. and my entire throat is burning. Mm -hmm. wow. But it's delicious. The flavor is so good. Mm. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna eat it. Mm. Good ramen soup. It's good delicious. Soup. Yeah, I think mm. this soup <laughs> may be one of my favorite ones. It's really, really delicious. If you like seafood flavor, mm. this one's really tasty. Mm. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> The next one, 
えー、じゃあ、そうばい、のんしん。のんしんいや、いつあー、ヤンニョンチキンラーメン。そんなヤンニョンチキン。あつか、スイートスパイシーチキン。だ、うん、that I love, by the way, fried chicken. And this one is a, a, it's a dry type of noodles, soupless noodles. And this one comes with two packages of something. Okay. And I guess、uh, we, we、uh, cook these noodles first, huh? Okay.、Mm. So this is one of those where you put the hot water in, you drain it, and then you put the sauce, you mix it up, you pour in the toppings. And it's quite interesting because the topping looks like nuts. It's like nuts and nori. On the bucket, <laughs> it says it's peanuts. Peanuts? Really? Mmm, it smells like the Korean fried、oh, chicken. It smells like the Korean aroma fried chicken. Of chicken. Yeah,、oh. the sauce, that sweet, spicy sauce.、Mm. But it doesn't really smell that spicy though.、Mm. Okay, interesting. I'm trying to image、mm. of this taste of ketchup. Ketchup? Yes. Okay. It, it looks spicy. Right. Image ketchup. Ketchup. Looks like, the color is, looks like ketchup. Right. <laughs> wow, that's amazing. They replicated the sauce for the Korean fried chicken. It's sweet. Yeah, it tastes just like this. Hmm, this is pretty amazing. Wow,、mm. uh, it is kind of strange eating the sauce with just the noodles, though. Like, it would be great if they actually had pieces of chicken in this. I don't know how they would do that, but. It would be kind of nice if they had chicken in here. The addition of the peanuts kind of is reminiscent of、uh, the crispy part of the fried chicken, a little bit. And there's also cabbage in here. They don't usually have cabbage in the chicken. For me, it's interesting. This taste is quite new. Sweet. Yeah. And it looks spicy, but it's not spicy.、Mm. What shall I say? I know, this is really hard to describe.、Mm. I don't know what this one is.、Uh, cheese. This cheese one is cheese bokki cup.、Mm -hmm. Cheese bokki cup. Right. Once again, I think bokki is short for topoki, which is the mochi. And,、uh, but this is like the ramen version. So it's like cheese ramen. <laughs> That's what it looks like. Yeah, I'm assuming that's what it is.、Mm. So, this one is also a soupless noodle.、Uh, pour hot water and wait for four minutes and drain hot water and put this powder. Cheese, cheese, cheese. Okay, let's eat. Yeah, it kind of reminds me of macaroni and cheese, but like a ramen version of that's it. That's right, that's right. Yeah, it kind of、mm. smells like it too.、It、smells very cheesy. It is definitely cheesy, but it's also a little bit sweet. It's like sweet cheese to me. Some kind of. Some kind of dashi.、Mm. Yeah, umami. Umami.、Mm. Mm. Some kind of umami.、Mm. It tastes like American mac and cheese, but with more umami. Cheese yakisoba.、Mm. Okay, so we have come to the last one, and this one is the only one that doesn't come in a cup. This one is the packaged one. But the reason we got this is because we have tried the, the super spicy、uh, ramen from Samyang, and this is a collaboration between Samyang and this other company that we cannot read because it's in Korean, but it is Buldak、uh, Ramen. Buldak Kimchi. Ramen or something like that. And after Googling, we found out that bulldog is a spicy chicken dish, Korean dish. And so、um, let's give this one a try. So basically, you boil this along with the packet of vegetables, then you drain it, you keep some of the liquid, you add in the sauce with the liquid, you give it a quick mix, and this is what you have a very red plate of noodles. It's very red. <laughs> It looks scary. I'm scared. Me too. Me too. But I am going to be hopeful, and hopefully, this one is tasty because the、mm -hmm. Samyang noodles are quite tasty,、mm -hmm. even though they're spicy. Ah, go ahead, go ahead. Smells spicy. Here we go. It's an interesting taste. 
It's a little bit sour. Yeah, it's like vinegar.、Mm. I didn't expect that. And it's not sweet. It's not, it's、mm. not sweet also. It's not spicy.、Mm. No. Yes, of course it's spicy, but not super spicy. No, it's actually a very nice level. Nice level. I like it. I like this. The noodle has a very nice texture. Yeah, yeah. Yeah.、Mm. Like perfect texture.、Mm. Like um, if I got this, I if I got served it at the restaurant, like this new no these noodles, like I would think they are fresh noodles. Like I I, I can imagine this with some toppings on the top. This reminds me a little bit of um. Hiyashi chuka, but spicy version. The noodle is a little bit bouncy. Yes, bouncy.、Mm. What like、are the, the, the Korean、uh, cold noodles? Yes. It's like a little bit bouncy.、Mm. It's like that. What is this?、Um, these vegetables? Is it kimchi? Is it freeze dried kimchi?、So. Like cabbage?、Mm. But the kimchi is super spicy. The in most interesting part is this sourness for me. Me too. Me too. Okay, so. We've tried eight different types、mm -hmm. of、uh, Korean、mm -hmm. instant noodles.、Mm -hmm. What did you think? My favorite one was the last one. Last one.、Mm -hmm. mm. The spicy level and the sourness and sweetness. It's not sweet, but the the balance was quite nice. It's spicy.、And、I like this. <laughs> spicy now. <laughs> me too. <laughs> but the balance is very good for me.、Mm. And I like this <clears throat> bouncy texture of noodles. Yes. My favorite one, and it's very very interesting because at first taste, for my first two bites, I wasn't that keen on it. But now I have to say my favorite one of、oh, all the, the chicken flavor one is a Yan Yan Kitchen a chicken one because it's unique. It reminds me a little bit about it reminds me a little bit of、uh, this like this、uh, crispy Thai noodles that I had in Thailand. It was sweet mikrob, I think it's called. It kind of reminds me of that. Well, we've come to the end. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, please leave your comments down below. And if you enjoy videos like this one, please make sure to subscribe, hit that like button, and if you haven't already done so, hit that notification bell so that you're notified whenever we release a new video. Thank you for watching. See you on next edition's video. Bye bye. Bye everybody. Bye bye.